today I want to uh, show you uh, a small application called Core Tile, uh, which is a uh, small uh, application that uses your uh, uh, desktop. Uh, in uh, this case, it, this is a Fossa Pup 96 a CE4 uh, Puppy Linux, and I just uh, uh, am completing the. Uh, uh, quick initial setup uh, and also I have the uh, obviously simple screen recorder activated so and then this is all done and then we'll go ahead and uh, clean up the uh, desktop a little bit so we can go ahead and present this uh, in a more uh, clear way so we'll just remove the items here and we'll also uh, get rid of conky here on the right so <coughs> kill all conky <coughs> so now uh, <coughs> what I want to do is just go ahead and uh, uh, go to the little introductory here so core tile is uh, uh, a tiling window manager so right now if I start any program for, for example here is genie <coughs> it just takes a small amount of uh, space on the <coughs> on screen but once the core tile uh, gets going what happens is that any program that's open will occupy the whole uh, screen so there's no wasted uh, space normally I have set up uh, <coughs> all my puppies with the BSPWM a tiling window manager but the, to set that up is somewhat complicated in the sense that you need a separate uh, key binding program. Uh, that means your uh, JWM uh, personnel file uh, with all your key binding and uh, JWM will not work. Uh, similarly, the tray <coughs> also cannot be used when you're using <coughs> uh, uh, typically a, a tiling window manager. And then it also, uh, you have to install nitrogen just to get a wallpaper uh, in a separate window compartment. And then some uh, Puppy Linux uh, will also, you will need to uh, replace this uh, volume control. And then, uh, despite a single very uh, simple uh, uh, program, it does have a single uh, configuration file, which is very easy to uh, uh, to manage and uh, so on. So I'll, what I wanted to show you mainly is to uh, to um, go ahead and uh, download this uh, file. So what we'll do is we'll go to the uh, uh, Pale Moon in my case, Fossa Pup, uh, just any uh, so what we'll search for is Core Tile and GitHub and see what pops up and then here is a, uh, a little uh, referral and then uh, what we can do is just go down to latest release and of course I'll put the uh, uh, the, uh, le uh, the web address in the description so that you're gonna go to the latest and then and then just go down to uh, I I have 64-bit machine, so I so I'll I'll need to use this, and make sure you don't get ARM 64 is AMD 64, and then we'll just click, and then it's downloading now, so we'll go to the open, uh, and then we'll just go ahead and just continue here, and what we need to do is extract it, so. Uh, Let's see. Extract. So it's a <coughs> it's an <coughs> right now it's on download folder. So I would rather want to uh, download in the same folder. So uh, we'll go to root and downloads. And so here it is. We want to extract in the same folder. And then here it is. And then extract. So it should be extracted, and we'll just open up uh, uh, rocks here. And then there's a uh, downloads here. 
and then so here is the uh, we'll take a look at the uh, folder itself and there is simply just one single file that's the main file so that's one binary file and um, that needs to be put in a startup uh, folder but I'll show that later but let's see what happens uh, if I just go ahead and uh, uh, activate it so here's Kotal just gonna simply just click on a left click and then now you can notice that instantly the uh, the uh, rocks uh, file manager has become very uh, large and it's taking up the whole space and let's go ahead and uh, click on a uh, terminal and it takes up uh, uh, the other half and then that can not uh, and then let's say what ha see what happens so there is a, a gap but that can be managed that that uh, I'll make that into two bi uh, two uh, pixels rather than 10 pixels that's default so that's the idea and then uh, there's no wasted space and uh, one uh, what I'll do is uh, I'm giving you a quick taste of what the program does let me just go ahead and show you something else. Let's just go ahead and start a, a browser now. Let's see what happens. <coughs> so now you can see that it starts here and you can certainly move it to another uh, workspace and so on. So that's the idea and we'll continue on with a uh, 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 with uh, my installed uh, configuration of a FOSA PUP 64CE4 without the Cortail uh, activated uh, just in default JWM uh, window manager next. Now I've, I've logged into uh, my own uh, 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 FOSA PUP 64CE4 uh, uh, with my uh, scripts and my keyboards and way I like to uh, work with uh, JWM uh, Desk Manager. So here I've uh, again is a core tile that was downloaded in my downloads uh, folder. So we'll just go ahead and click and then here is the main file that we need to do. Uh, we need to put, put, put it so in Puppy Linux what we can do is just put it in startup uh, here so we can go ahead and drag this over here and then put a copy right there and then what we can do is just go to the startup and we'll just click single click and see what happens so we've, uh, we will go back to the uh, so when we go back to the uh, f the folder again, here is the startup folder that's tiled now. So uh, actually, this is the uh, startup folder right here, root startup folder that's tiled. The code code tile is activated now. So that's how simple it is just to go ahead and get it activated. Now we want to take a brief look at the. Uh, uh, we'll just go ahead and close that and then we'll go to the uh, main root folder and then dot config and then you can go into core tile uh, directory now uh, that's been created now and then this is the uh, configuration file of uh, uh, core tile so we'll go ahead and right click and then we'll open it with genie and here is the uh, main configuration file. We'll just close it. So here, this is a uh, configuration file on the default setting. Uh, let, let me see. The default setting, the gap is 10. So I put the uh, gap at 2. So and then the other thing that I changed is the uh, uh, on a default setting that this will this window the application that opens uh, using a uh, core tile will overlap with a uh, 
with the JWM tray uh, bar here. So I've uh, I'm I given a command of top here, margin of tiling area and primary screen. I given a 31 because normally this uh, in mine uh, is tiling is 30 pixels. So I just given a 31 pixel. So you just get a little glimpse of a window right underneath. Um, and then I think that that's the main thing that uh, you may want to uh, s uh, set up initially. And then the other thing that's been very helpful for me is if to sh uh, toggle between uh, enabling and disabling the current screen uh, quartile is Control Shift T. Most of the uh, uh, a keyboard in quartile is really a uh, shift and control which is really excellent it has less chance of being interfering with a my setup of jwm dash personnel file of my keyboards so uh, we can just take a brief look at the uh, my own keyboards here um, so it uh, most of them controls uh, control shift I do have few, uh, so you may have to make sure that uh, it it doesn't uh, it doesn't get interfered. Um, but the main thing is that with mine, uh, there is uh, no obvious uh, interference uh, with a keyboard here and a keyboard and uh, config file of. Uh, uh, core uh, tile so and uh, I find that this is very helpful in uh, resetting uh, control shift and T to uh, quickly uh, disable or enable uh, uh, core tile uh, uh, function so let me just show you here and we'll just go ahead and start the uh, uh, three uh, three uh, uh, rocks here and then when I just uh, control shift and T see what happens these windows here say so it uh, changes now it's actually in a regular floating mode so now I'm gonna go back and uh, uh, toggle the c uh, core tile again control shift and T and see it goes back to the uh, tiling mode so uh, it's not extensive uh, review and how to use, but I just want to quickly introduce you this really uh, uh, well thought out, thought out program that uh, you can still use your own mouse uh, function and all your keyboards and then uh, the menu. Uh, uh, so these are uh, usually not when, what you expect in a separate tiling window manager but core tile have this mark this significant advantages of the, you can use the uh, mouse and also keyboard uh, menu system that's uh, inherent in JWM for example and for for now I've uh, removed the BSP uh, WM tiling window manager in all the puppies because I find this has a significant advantages and it's much simpler to set up and I hope you find it helpful.